What's going on, guys? Check back in with another awesome Blu-ray purchase. I picked up a couple things over the weekend. Thought I'd share them with you guys, as I usually do. Um, I picked up a, a few uh, classic 80s slasher films. So, without further ado, let's get started with... From Screen Factory, I've got the collector's edition of Black Christmas. Now, this is a great title in the fact, or especially this time of year, this is a twofer. Because this is a great uh, for Halloween and Christmas. So, there you go. <laughs> That glare there. Sorry about that. Yeah. Obviously, two disc collector's edition. Your film. Your special features. Now again, very. This has been out for some time. So this is. I just got this recently. Saw him Sands uh, slip cover, but there's the artwork that would have been on the slip cover. I got. There you go. So. But this is a. Very, that's one of the first, I guess, modern slasher films, I guess, um, preceding even Halloween, which most of you probably know that, but a good little, good little thriller, one I really enjoy. Next up, we get to the gruesome section now. Uh, I picked up from Blue Underground, The Prowler. AKA Rosemary's Killer. Oh. Your chapel. There's not a whole lot in this, but it's a great, great jump scare. This, you know, good uh, Tom Savini visual effects. I actually saw this at the drive-in last year. This is pretty cool. So you can see that. So yeah, it's good to get this from Blue Underground. You've got audio commentary of Joseph Zito and Tom Savini. So yeah. Next up is another one from Blue Underground. This time it's Maniac and a new 4K restoration. And this is another one of those kind of gruesome ones. With Joe Spinell. And this has got a lot of good features on here. Two-disc edition. It's a feature. All your extras. Let me pull that. I can't really see that. It's too well. Look at those crazed eyes. <laughs> so, yeah. This is another really good, some good gory effects in this. Great uh, Tom Savini head explosion, which is great. And a lot of this is just very disturbing content, honestly. But... It's worth having in the collection. Not one I probably pull out on a regular basis, but who knows? I can be sick like that sometimes. <laughs> and the last one I got here was something I picked over, up over the weekend at the drive in, at the Skyline drive in, when they had their um, drive in massacre weekend where they were showing a full weekend of a bunch of really great uh, horror films. And they had a vendor's table, and uh, seven films had a table there. And we're selling a lot of their stuff. And I walked by and I could not help but pick up Burial Ground. A uh, notorious little zombie film, I guess, with this creepy little guy right here. This creepy little guy. That's all I can say. That image pretty much says it all right there. <laughs> but it's a great uh, special edition. A lot of good features on there and leave extra scenes. And this is another really disturbing in terms of, of gore. And just how many of the gore, but it's like one particular scene. And this is a tight slip cover, too. My goodness. Ugh. And there's the original artwork. Contains scenes which are considered shocking, and no one under 17 will be admitted. I think this is also known as the Gates of Hell, as an alternate title. 
and you've got alternate slip work cover, bury your ground. So this is a nice little find. And it's like this was a, like I said, it was on the table there for 20 bucks. And it's like, well, I cannot pass that up, and I did not. <laughs> this is a great little, little you know, I think I believe this is uh, I want to look this is Spanish or it's Italian. I'm pretty sure it's Italian. But this is a good little zombie film. Creepy, disturbing, a gruesome. Again, one really creepy, disturbing image because of that guy right there. That little guy right there. Yeah. <laughs> so that is it for this. Really quick. Put these up here. We can see them. Haul. I said a couple of good... 80 slashers, one little creepy zombie film. <laughs> and so, yeah, that is it for now. Um, I have a couple things coming in here today uh, that I'll be showing with you later. But for now, this is a little quick and, quick and dirty video. And that is it for now. Until next time, this is Chuck saying see you later.